Hi beautiful, today we are going to walk through the process of what it takes to get a PRP facial. So first, we just have to do a standard blood draw. Just something that you would get at like core or something like that. We just take a tube of blood. Um, a simple process, really doesn't hurt, and it's very standard. take it over to the centrifuge and we're just going to spin it down for several minutes. Um, we'll remove it from its tube and you can clearly see there's a difference where after it's spun in the centrifuge you can see the plasma has separated from the red blood cells. Once we remove the plasma from the centrifuge, we take it into the procedure room where you will be and we draw all of that liquid gold right out of that tube. We make sure to not get any of the red blood cells mixed in. So we have just pure liquid gold. And that's where all of the rejuvenating properties are gonna be. with a little medication so that we really just help all of those good properties just activate so that they know where to go and how long to stay there. So here we are just wiping the numbing cream off. We did do some numbing and um, we actually didn't get video of that, but um, she is numb. We've let the numbing medication sit and really work in and make sure she's um, really, really taken care of. Um, we're just wiping that down. We'll do a standard cleaning with something like an herbal wash. We make a plan for the face according to what this patient particularly wanted to focus on. So we start micro needling in a pattern that is appropriate for this particular patient's age and skin type. After we've microneedled a section, we're gonna take a little applicator and apply the plasma onto that section. We let the plasma dry and really soak into the skin well. Then we move on to the next section. We know that this patient really would like to focus around the eyes. So we're really taking our time, making sure we have gotten a good amount around the eyes from microneedling in that pattern. We do a crosshatch pattern and also a circular motion. After this, we will again apply the plasma on top so that we are applying as we are microneedling. This particular PRP facial 
is also known by the name of the vampire facial. Although we do not do anything re that resembles anything like a vampire. It's just that once you leave, your face is red and inflamed. So, you know, it looks a little like a vampire. We're taking the blood. So that's why a lot of people refer to it as that. Um, actually, the PRP facial is for tighter and firmer skin. It improves the tone and texture of your skin. And a lot of people use it to reduce the visibility of wrinkles. Um, we also use it for reducing acne and just to overall rejuvenate the skin and the skin tone and texture. We just want that tighter, firmer looking youthful skin. long enough for us to do the procedure and make sure that we get everything we can accomplish. At the very end of the procedure, we're going to top off the skin with a tissue repair cream that has copper peptide in it to help with healing. 